And there you see a great view of the nicer X-ray telescope in front of NASA astronaut Nick Cave, who will install patches and those circles that have each Happy little increase in running well torches on the side for those patches. There's 56 of those select ones identified by the nicer experiment and the team on the ground here, both in Houston and across the country have identified areas where unwanted light is entering communication and there with Sonny Hague Williams, will be NASA identifying and patching up so it can return to its full capacity. The replacement planar reflector in place, talking of the turns and torque used by her tools to affix that replacement of the planar reflector. Nick, Just off the your, uh, zenith the port of the harmony module. And a uh, nicer team on the is uh, happy with the work. And Sunny. Inside that crew lock, Nick Hague and Sonny Williams prepare for US EVA spacewalk number 91 and today's planned tasks. Now, seven and a half minutes into today's EVA, we'll open things up as you see there and get ready to right, traverse happy, out into the vacuum of space. The airlock. You're going to be attaching your anchor hook to forward and Sunny's to aft. And that is EV-1, Nick Haig, the first one to pop out of the hatchway of the crew lock of the International Space Station. I'm coming out. Okay. Your tether is right in front of you. Okay. And I, I have my CRT tether on the lock bag. Okay. Right now. Tethers are tended nice right directly in front of you, so clear your legs. What is there? You're good. Safety tethers are just strung out in front of you towards your tether point. You're good. Okay. That's astronaut Nick Haig wearing the suit with red stripes. EV-1 exit the Quest airlock, and Sunny Williams was just making her way out of the hatch herself. And while they make their way across, flight controllers have given the command to power down the rate gyro assembly at number two. As both Nick Haig and Sunny Williams make their way over to that portion of the International Space Station trust system, and again, that rate gyro to remove and replace provides orientation data on all three axes of the International Space Station. That is today's priority task of U.S. Spacewalk number 91. And this is all part of the ISS assembly maintenance and upgrades for today's planned four tasks. This is the first of those four. And there is a great look at Expedition 72 Commander Sonny Williams with Nick Haig just above her on the truss of the International Space Station. Translating across that truss to begin work on the rate gyro assembly unit number two replacement.